to stand with me this morning. Let's get us a deer this morning. Um, appreciate y'all being with me. I appreciate all my subscribers. Thank y'all for watching. Appreciate your support. And uh, I'm just out here trying to get it done this morning. I'm uh, looking for another doe. I got my sausage the other day on the other video. And uh, I made about 40 pounds of sausage off of her all together. So. And it's, it's good too. And uh, But this morning I'm looking for Miss uh, Cube Steak. I gotta give him some cube steak put in the freezer now. And I'm gonna try it. I'm, I'm gonna get one more after that. Um, I generally get three here on my farm every year. So, uh, um, but this stand I'm sitting in this morning, it's on a seven acre field, my big field right here at my house. And uh, it's got oats and clover in it. And I put oats and clover in it and it's, it's doing real good. I, I planted it double and uh, you can see where I planted it double out there. <laughs> It's in strips, I didn't do it too good. <laughs> but anyway, it don't matter. Uh, but the frost has done hit here now, last week. And it was about 31 degrees, and it was real white, real white frost. And it's done killed everything now, so these deer, they'll start coming to this green stuff. And uh, I seen seven out here last night when I come home from work. And uh, my cousin called me and told me there's been some hogs coming across the road between me and my brother's house. So tonight I'm gonna probably get out here and sit for a little while and see if I can't see a hog. They, they like to graze on oats. I've shot them out here before. I've seen them up here grazing on these oats. So they like oats. But anyway, um, I'd like to thank all my subscribers and uh, appreciate y'all watching this morning. You know, it's a beautiful morning. It's it's not raining, it's, the sun's gonna come up in a little bit, it's gonna be a beautiful morning. And uh, just another day that the Lord has made, it's just a beautiful day. And uh, But the reason I'm sitting here in this stand this morning is the other morning I sat in my black stand down below me here, and I run, I run three stands, and uh, the reason I'm sitting in this one is because when I pulled up here at the house, I didn't see nothing in that black stand and I got through down there, and when I pulled up here at the house, I seen seven deer right here under this stand. So, you know, you can't win for losing a lot of times, but I'm gonna see if I can get me one here in my good stand this morning here at the house. I see a lot of does right here. They like this big field. I like getting out here and running around in it. So, uh, y'all just hang with me in this morning. Let's see if we can get Miss Cube Steak. I'm in hot pursuit of Miss Cube Steak now. I got about six packs in the freezer left in them. Um, I need to get about 30, I used to get run about 30 packs of cube steak a year, so. It's between me and my dad, so it's just me and him. But uh, I'm gonna try to get it done this morning, y'all. Uh, y'all sit back and get you a little cup of coffee, drink you some new lattes or whatever. And uh, y'all just enjoy the video with me. And, uh, I appreciate uh, doing them. And letting y'all see what I'm doing here in the old country. I love it out here. You get a lot of freedom. And I'd like to pre uh, do a shout out to all the servicemen and women overseas. We love you guys. And just, y'all are, are heroes. I mean, it's just, we love you guys. And it's just a hard thing to go to, you know, have to, these wars and all that's going on right now. It's part of what's predicted in the Bible, so. Jesus said in the last days that dangerous and perilous times are coming. He didn't say we was going to have a big old party. And, uh, but it's just the way it is. It's the way it's going. It's where we're going. It's just getting madder and madder every day. And I pray for all the servicemen and women overseas that's probably in harm's way and just looking over this country. I know, I know it's hard. and then Be away from your families and all, but I want to shout out to y'all, all your servicemen and service women overseas and I just wanted to express that to y'all and uh but this morning I'm gonna give it all I got I gotta I gotta see what's in here I hadn't been seeing them here in the evening much now that could change right now they right over here below me I got a little ravine over here below me here in this field and it's got all oak trees in it and what they're doing is they're eating these acorns we got a pretty good acorn crop right now. And, uh, but they're mainly eating them. 
and then they kind of come up here after dark and eating oats here after dark in the in at night. And I reckon that must be the icing on the cupcake or something, if you if you say it that way, I guess. But anyway, I'm gonna sit here a little while. I'm gonna, I may sit here at about ten o'clock this morning. It's uh it's seven oh seven right now. And uh I'll see what's going on. But I pulled up here at nine I pulled up here the other morning at nine o'clock and them does they were right up under the stand. So they might have been walking late. They were walking late because it was so cold. It was like thirty one degrees. Big old heavy frost. It was like it snowed. But everything's dead now. The old frost had killed everything, so but I'm gonna look this morning. But y'all, y'all uh enjoy the video this morning. And uh that's what we can kill old Miss Cube steak this morning. Y'all ready? Let's get it. Hey, uh, while I'm thinking about it, I'm gonna probably do some late season hunting uh, in this particular field right here. I don't know what it is, but the bucks that I've got here, they tend to show up late season. I've seen a lot of bucks out here in the later part of the season. And what they're doing is uh, it's 11-6 now. It's the 6th of November. And it's early. And they haven't really got in the rut here good yet as far as a heavy rut. Um, and I haven't seen any bucks chasing any does at all here on the farm. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to try a late season hunt this time. I'm going to change up a little strategy. Um, I haven't done it in the past. And right here in this big field, right in this seven acre field, there's does when they come out here. I've seen a lot of the bucks come out here late in late season. In the last part of the season. I mean January, I'm talking about the last part of it. But I may try something like that this time. And just look and see what's going on. But, uh, I'll just enjoy the morning. It's beautiful. The sun's coming up right now, so. She was finna walk in the thing. He just come out here. Give her a few minutes now. They come out right here to the right here to the right of me. They come out in this field just for a few minutes. They never stopped. They just kind of walked out here a little bit, played. And then he's over there. That's all right. Go on, get Miss Cube Steak. She's down, y'all. Appreciate y'all watching. I just happened to see him out of the corner of my eyes. I don't know why that keeps going out, but he, he took a picture. But I got her. Woo! Man, I got one more to go. Let's go check her out. You already go check her out? Let's go check her out. Everybody got out of my stand and there was two up here at the end of the field. Y'all can't see them. Y'all can't see them and there's two does right there. They're way up at the end of the field. 
I don't know if you can see them on my GoPro or not. It was two big does right there. I was, there's my stand right yonder, right over there. And the deer is right there. Let's go see what we got. Let's see what we got this morning. Oh yeah. Oh, Miss, Miss Q's take. Heck it. Oh yeah. I saw these three, and I saw, when I got out of the stand just a few minutes ago, I seen two more at the top of the hill. They were finna go in the, they like they finna go back to bed. They'd been down to eating acorns probably. So anyway, I got her. I got her right there, so. We're gonna make cute steak out of her. Appreciate y'all watching this morning. And it's a beautiful morning, I'm telling you. Look out there. Look how pretty it is this morning. It's a beautiful morning this morning. So, hey, y'all take care, and uh, we'll see you on the next hunt. I got one more I'm going to do. Probably one more. I either kill about three here on my farm a year. So I'm going to do one more hunt, and I appreciate everybody watching. Y'all God bless and take care. And this is Real Country Live, signing out.